She's one of the most compassionate people I've ever seen, especially for children. She is, without question, one of our most loyal alums. What do you wish for? You know, when you see a shooting star, you find an eyelash, or you say, toss a penny into a fountain? For my kids to be all right, of course. For Alabama to win another BCS championship. She has stayed in touch with this university. She has never failed to respond to requests that we've made. It is so appropriate for the University of Alabama to be honoring CELA in this way. Roll Tide, I'm from Alabama. I <laughs> went to undergrad in Tuscaloosa. CELA Ward grew up in Meridian, Mississippi. During her time at the University of Alabama, she was a cheerleader in the Bryant glory years. Here was this woman who was so intellectually talented, so compassionate, so hardworking, so exquisitely beautiful. She didn't need to be kind. And yet, I've known few students as kind as Celia Ward. After graduation, modeling opened the door to a distinguished television and film career including a three-season lead in the CBS series, CSI New York. She's won an Emmy, she's won a Golden Globe Award, and she's won a Cable Ace Award. So she's established herself as a uh, great performer. Uh, secondly, she's one of the most compassionate people I've ever seen. She's changing the world in Mississippi through her efforts with Hope Village. This is the story of a village called Hope, where abused, abandoned, and neglected children find a home and a future. It's a unit that accommodates 54 children at any one time uh, who have been neglected. She's changing the world one child at a time. She is vitally, vitally interested in Meridian, Mississippi. She uh, approached me to take on a project. It was a turn of the century opera house that had stood in disrepair for 60 years. We took the project on. Uh, together, we raised around $30 million. And Celia and I went off to Washington one day to sell the congressional delegation. She spoke. And when she finished speaking, one of the delegation members stood up, slammed his fist on the table and said, this is a project we must do. Sela seldom ever asked the question, why? Sela always asks, why not? The value to the reputation of the institution of Sela's loyalty is absolutely incalculable. She has a great love for history and tradition, and she has worked hard in her life to uh, make great commitments to that, and I'm awfully proud to know her. Hey everybody, this is Hill Harper, and I just want to say congratulations, congratulations, congratulations to one of the most amazing women in the world, my friend, my colleague, Celia Ward. Uh, you know, Celia Ward graduated from the University of Alabama's communications major, and she told me she was a cheerleader. And she said, roll tide. And she said all these things. So I just want to say, listen, Celia, I'm wearing, I mean, this isn't quite, you know, Alabama colors, but I tried to get as close as I could. Uh, Celia, congratulations. There's nobody in the world that's more deserving of being a member of a Hall of Fame because to me you represent what true fame is. You are a humble, you are beautiful, you are intelligent, and you care about other people. Hope Village is an example of that. I was so proud to help you with that and, and I want to help you in whatever way I can and continue to go on, keep going. Congratulations University of Alabama. Congratulations to Celia Ward. Roll Tide! Celia, you're a wonderful friend, a great colleague, philanthropist, but most of all, 
you're an inspiration to others. So congratulations on the momentous achievement and roll tide.